quick and we're going to jump into it. Thank you, Father God, for this beautiful blessing day. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Let me say thank you just for everything, Father. You are my God and I love you. Thank you. Amen. All right, y'all. Today, we got some, uh, well, let me see. Wait a minute. Is that better? Mm-hmm. We have some Domino's pizza, y'all. You know what? I will, I ordered some uh, chicken, uh, jalapeno chicken bites. Y'all, they got cheese on it, too. I never seen them before. That's why I was trying something a little different. Y'all see that? Let me see if I can pick one up. It's chick, it, say, it say chicken bites and with this cheese. I don't know. Oh, we got some uh, pineapple. Oh, jalapeno pineapple. Okay, I hope it's good. My first time. And of course, I got my favorite Italian sausage and uh, banana peppers. So yeah, oh, oh, y'all already know I'm missing something, right? Cocktail, my cocktail. All right, so this is going to be... Uh, just for all my new subscribers that I got. Oh my God, y'all coming in. Come on in. Keep your eyes on the videos, though. We need the eyes, y'all. But this is going to be a toast for the beautiful um, weekend. I hope you guys are going to have a beautiful weekend. I am. I got the whole week off next week. My birthday. Woo! I am so ready. Yes, yes, yes. So, salute. Salute. Sip, sip, sip that good hood stuff. Yes, toast, baby. I'm going to... Oh, that's good. I'm going to dive in. Uh, I was uh, on live with uh, Coco Tell Him today, this morning. That girl, she crazy as hell. But she is so fun. She says the truth. Coco Tell Him, let me spell it. I'm going to put her name in my description box, too. K-O-K-O. -K -O. I said, I told y'all another time to go, go, such out, baby. Go look at her. She's funny. It's K-O-K-O. T-E-L-L-M. -T no. T-E-L-L-E-M. Coco Tell Lim. So, I'm going to put it down in the description box, y'all. Um, she was right on point this morning. And then we got into a relationship. Conversation. Woo! This is, that chicken is hot, y'all. My God. Mmm. Oh, my. We was talking about a video that I put out. When your feelings change, when y'all not on the same page, you still be trying to come back. Coco, girl, listen. I got a text, right? <laughs> and the text said, hey, babe. No, hey, sweetheart. I'm down here in your town in Kima, and I'm at T. Tom's Steakhouse. Come and join me. Mm, that's good. Kind of cold, though. You know what I did? I had to struggle with some of my thoughts, and then I said, I got to text him back so he won't be waiting. If I... Don't correspond with you. Why are you still chasing me? You Well, women, we want men to chase us. But we have to be on the same page in the same book. So, Coco, I text him back and I say, I'm sorry, I'm unavailable until next week. <laughs> so, he texts back. He said, okay, baby, enjoy. I didn't respond at that one. Men, I'm talking to you. I'm going to take my glasses off and tell you, look in my eyes. In the look of my eyes, look in my eyes. 
we want y'all to chase us. I'm an old school girl. I want to be chased. But if uh, we meet and we like each other, we got to talk a lot. We got to hang out a lot. We got to do things together. Even if it's under a tree, we meet land in your lap or you land in my lap. You know, we have a bottle of wine, some chicken wings, <laughs> some chips, and just hang out, just hang out together. You know, we'll know if we are really truly about one another. You know, so this is a lesson. If you don't like the girl or women, if you don't like him, just put it out there. You know, I did tell him my feelings changed. You know, like four weeks ago, five weeks ago. He must have forgot it. Whatever I did for the impact, I like that. I, I like the impact. Whatever I said, I preached to him. It, he, he thought about it and he's changed some things, but I'm not there anymore. And I think about it. Mm -hmm. I think about it. But I don't want to go backwards. I don't. Ooh, that pineapple's good. So, we have to understand that sometimes you can just be friends. It's okay to be friends. You don't have to be lovers all the damn time. Just be friends sometimes. Everybody you meet not supposed to be in your bed. Not supposed to be in your arms. Sometimes, you know, back in the day, we, men and women, we had friends, you know, platonic friends. Oh, nothing about no sex or something. We used to, if we wasn't interested in you, our girlfriend, we'd say, you know, I want you to meet somebody. Here, take him. <laughs> take him. <laughs> but mm, I think because things are so different, dating is different, I think everybody people meet, they want to try to see if they're compatible. Honey, sometimes it's just a friend. I don't mind telling a nigga that. Oh, I ain't mean to say that. But y'all know what I'm saying. I don't mind telling you. <laughs> Dude, I like you. But, you know, I am I really want to be your friend. You, you know, I got a lot of men in the friend zone. And they're going to stay in the friend zone. Mm-hmm. One day I will meet that man that I want in the hood zone. <laughs> mm -hmm. Y'all, this chicken is kind of different. It got cheese and jalapeno, habanero, pineapple. It's a lot of stuff going on. It don't taste bad, but I won't buy it again. It don't taste bad at all. But I won't buy it again. I was trying, you know, I like chicken wings with the bones I can suck. So, Coco Tellum was talking about building your brand, your, your account. I'm still new. That girl hit on some good old points. Be you. <laughs> so, you know what, Coco? Thank you, beautiful. I'm already being me. I will always be me. You know, when I learned myself, I know who this hood girl really, really is. Um, I'm happy. You know, whether I have 152 people or what 152,000, you know, sometimes things go slow and it's for a reason. So you can be, you know, sometimes you got to be happy with that little because. If you're satisfied with this much, you'll know how to appreciate this much. You know what I mean? So, been there, done that, baby. I told this girl learned a lot years ago. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, that's why I am today. Coco Tavern, food, uh, 
for the soul. Coco, tell them, told me to look at Vern's closet or whatever that is. I am going to do that. But all the people I'm mentioning, go look at them. They have, you know, they have positive vibes. That's, that's who you want to be around. You know, and all of them are different. But all of them have a good message. So I laugh. I laugh. Don't go tell them just have me laughing, y'all. <laughs> I, I, I can't laugh. <laughs> so, all the new subscribers, whoever y'all subscribe with, really look at their videos. We do need your eyes. It's easy to subscribe. That's the easy part. So I'm going to tell you what you do. You can do to the hood girl. Put me on blast. One video after another. If you don't want to hear everything, just cut the volume down, but just let it play. <laughs> but I want you to listen. Sometimes I have a good message, y'all. Look at that. Oh, yeah, what the hell? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what that is, y'all. Some burnt cheese. Ooh. That's nasty. And it's hot. <coughs> well, that's burnt cheese and jalapeno together. <laughs> Y'all, just be beautiful people. You know, that's really hot. My love is so robust, it's so beautiful. Only because God taught me love. Because, you know, if y'all knew my story in the back, I didn't have it. I didn't know I didn't know how to feel love. I didn't know what love was until he taught me. I, I'm just, that's why I could be happy, you know. So, I am so glad to be in the company of all y'all. All of you. Official. I like you, official. You straight up. Mm -hmm. Look here. I'm, I'm stuck on relationships, y'all. Shit. Did I spit? <laughs> Ooh. Did I? <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of our relationship. I don't have a degree in counseling, but I can be the best counselor that you can you can have. I was talking to my best friend last night, and we was just discussing what we like in a man, you know, what we require in a man. So, if you met a man, and y'all have good conversation and, you know, you really do genuinely like one another. You smile, you talk, and if he didn't dress like you want, or like you're used to a man dressing, like you want your man to dress, if he didn't have the car or the truck, whatever you like, if he didn't drive that, if he had one, two, right here, I'm oh, sorry. If he had one tooth right here that looked like gold, but it wasn't gold, it got a dentist at every corner. But with all those, would you deny yourself, even if even if you believe in your heart that it could be some good love, not love making, but good love, would you turn him to a dentist to get that, that tooth fixed? Would you ask him, you know, Come on, let's go to the mall and it just say, you know what? Oh, that's a beautiful shirt. Have you ever worn this color? Try it on. Let me see what it looks like. To under, you know, to help him dress, you know, because every man that we meet, or, or, or men, every woman that you meet, some of us just don't know. We don't know how to dress. Nobody taught us. We don't know how to love because nobody taught us that. We don't know how to care because no one taught us that either. So sometimes people come into your lives for a lesson or a blessing, if not both. So sometimes we got to remove ourselves out of the way and see that other person 
to hear that other person and understand that they may not know. We don't know what the background is. We don't know how they were raised. We don't know what the last four, two, three, one relationships was. If that woman taught, if that man taught, if they gave, if they take, we don't know. And that's what our conversation was about last evening. Now, how long am I going to hold this damn glass for I sip? Because I'm on a roll. Mm. Give me two of these, honey. My, my mouth goes up. It, 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 it never stops. Yeah, I'm telling y'all, once I go live with my cigar and a cocktail, hoo, 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 be ready. We're going to talk about sex. <laughs> sex. Money. Men, women. That's what we're going to talk about. So, yeah. Would you deny yourself the right love if if, if, if he had the wrong shoes or if he had the wrong uh, 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 attire uh, when y'all go out and you look like, oh, shit, where he going with that on? <laughs> you know? If he had that one near gold tooth and it's not a real gold. Mm-hmm. But you deny it if you knew, if you knew in your heart that that was your man or your 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 potential boo thing. Mm -mm. Yeah, I can say for me, I can answer that for me. I want y'all to answer too. I had a man with a near a near a near 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 goal. Let me let me use one of these dogs. <laughs> y'all gonna call me crazy. I don't care. Look, that's a near goal. <laughs> That's that dear girl too. I had one. You just coerce them, you know. If they get, if they still looking at all your beautiful teeth, and you know, it's sometimes you know people got to see it because nobody else told them. You know what I mean? Because maybe they were with somebody with some raggedy ass teeth. Hell, who knows? But if you like them, if you really, really like them. You know, I have a good dentist. I'll, I'll refer you to my dentist. He'll take good care of your teeth. It's just... <laughs> your teeth, y'all. I know how to talk. <laughs> but he will. You know, it's a mall. It's, 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 you know, it's stores everywhere you go, even if it's a $7 store. I don't buy them $7 clothes because the first wash, I would, I would believe that they uh, unravel. I don't know. But it's a JCPenney everywhere. It's a Macy's everywhere. Hell, it's a mall. Like five miles from your house, from somebody's house. Let's go shopping. Mm -hmm. Let's do that. Let's shop. Mm -hmm. That's what the hood girl do. But my thought right now is how many men and women won't do, won't help, knowing that that's the best girl you will ever meet. And I think sometimes when we get ourselves in the way, we could lose that one love that we prayed about for many, many years because of. Think about that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Think about it. But today, shoot, I meet everybody. But you know what? I meet a lot of men that I only want in my darn friend zone. And I, I want men to understand when you get in, in my friend zone, you can't kiss me, you can't hold my hand, your damn show can't have sex with me. You're your friend. Now that boo friend, if I call you boo friend, meaning that we don't have no commitment, but you my boo, it's a possibility, baby. You can get knee drives. You can get, well, oops. Who am I talking too much? Because <laughs> this is what we're gonna talk about when I go live. So get ready, all my good people. Yeah, let me let me get off this video. Mm -hmm. Girl, I'm so ready. I am so ready to blossom, y'all. You know, I had to plant the seed first. Now I'm getting watered, and and not water for myself. All y'all who subscribing to my page, y'all watering my seed. Thank you. Now, you know, with my mama, who's a gardener, I, she always showed me the steps of gardening. And so now that I planted the seed, all my subscribers who are watering my seed, 
Now I see the blossoms and the flowers that are growing and blooming. Yeah. Over time, I'm going to have a big old giant uh, stalk with a whole lot of branches. The ones that for me going to stick and stay. The ones who are not for me, they're going to fall off and I'm already ready for it. So thank you for all the encouragement. Coco, tell them.